I'm thankful that my parents give birth to a sister. <laughs> because if not, I don't know what I'll do. Hi, my name is Jaylee. Hi, my name is Haley. And together, we are Jade, Jade on the Hay. Hay. Today, we're in our car ride, riding with Asia One. So, buckle up. We are in for a ride. Let's go. So today we are going to play a game, it's called the Two Truth, One Lie. Mm, basically, we will be saying or uh, telling you guys uh, three statements that we came up with and uh, there will be two facts and one lie. Yep. We have to guess which one is a lie. Yep. And I think it's a common misunderstanding that uh, twins know each other to the bones. But uh, fortunately, I think we are very close. Yep. So let's hope we get it right. Yep. <laughs> Prior to this ride, right? We like this paper stone. And I lost. So I guess I'm going first. Yep. Number one, I love roller coasters. Number two, I love social gatherings. Number three, I love to neck. Neck, neck, neck. Oh my god, everything seems like a truth, eh? You love social gathering, man. Oh, you love to neck. Yeah, it's true, she loves to neck. So, what is the fact? What's the lie? The fact is, she loves to neck. She she loves social gathering. She also loves roller coaster, le. So which one is your answer? The final answer. Five, four, the three, lie, uh, the lie, uh. two, Ayo. one. Okay, lor, you don't love to nag, oh. Yeah, I don't love to nag. Well, she loves to nag at home, eh. She always nag, 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 nag. I'm the youngest at home. But well, yeah, she acts like she's a. I'm, I don't act like I'm the oldest, okay? That's because you see, look at the childishness of yeah. this Haley Wu. I nag at people I love because I want the best for them. But that is not a fact. I don't like to nag. That's the thing. But I got no choice but to nag. You know what I mean? So it's very different from like me loving to nag. And yeah, everything under the world she will nag on. Like we play games also can nag. Then we, we, yesterday I was playing uh, games with her, she said, like, Oh my god, why are you so lousy? You cannot come here. Really, I'm carrying you, I'm the MVP, you know? The part about social gatherings, uh, Hailey actually doubted that you really love social gatherings. Okay, le. I mean, compared to the last time, like, if it's, it's the old Jaylee asking this question, I would say uh, she won't like it. But right now, I feel like she's enjoying it. Do you want to make it a point to really hang out with friends like, every week or whatsoever? Uh, I don't, I mean, but okay like if there's like TV, I would go for sure because I love singing. Dinner-wise, I think we will do it um, wherever we have the time to, where everybody can gather, I guess. I think it's about making an like, effort, effort like, yeah, you have to true. put a conscious effort to meet out with your friends. And I think for me, right, it's very hard for me to really just uh, plan something because I fear rejection. Sometimes when I organize a meeting and then no one turns up, I'll be like sad, totally disappointed and then I would not do it again. I was in a good group chat for this show, right? I just asked, hey, do you guys want to hang? Do you guys want to meet up for dinner or something to catch up? And everybody don't reply me eh. The thing is they double tick me, no. Ayo, I got very upset, no. <laughs> because like, how come I'm making an effort? But the thing is nobody is like appreciating it eh. Jilly, is it you love roller? Coasters. I do. Yeah, I do. Look, roller coaster is fun. I, I think I have a knack for um, high speed stuff. Yeah, high really? speed stuff. I think it's because um, I get to push boundaries, like in in the sense of my own fear. Shall we move on to my sister's two, like, truth and one lie? <laughs> okay, so the three statements are I would love to skydive one day. I would love to have a free diving license one day. And I would love to go for bungee jump again. Ayo, so obvious. <laughs> obvious man. <laughs> the lie is you would want to go to bungee jump again. You are right. I'm always right, yeah, because I'm on the right side. <laughs> Bungee jump, why never again? Oh my god, so scary, I cannot. I thought I, I am ready for it. She's a kunyang, eh. She's and a I thought I wanted to challenge the, you know, the the, the, the tallest one in the Macau. But after trying the one in Sentosa, I'm like, no, I, I'm not going to do it anymore. 
Okay lah, I think because I went down the wrong way or something Cause like my, my leg was hooked with the rope So I got like heat rash or something It hurts like hell And then when I go down I, I literally contemplated for maybe 20 minutes Then I'm like no! I really legit want to go back already But okay lah, it's being paid for so don't waste Don't waste the money So I went for it anyway So you're afraid of heights? Yeah, I am No, I'm okay with roller coaster and stuff But I'm not okay with like Having to, you know, jump off is like I don't know, the feeling is so scary Like, I don't want to jump off that small thingy, the platform And You don't know what will happen Like, it, it feels like my heart is like Going like coming out this of is the part mouth. that she's contradicting herself. She always like, uh, I want to be YOLO, you only live once. And then when she's on the platform, she cannot jump down. I don't know why. Oh, of course, cool. Yeah. But yeah, you want to skydive. Exactly. Skydive is different. Okay, okay. How different it is? It's jumping off something. It's also a small platform, what? Hello? Okay, because I tried <gasps> indoor skydiving before. That's different, And what? I'm good at it. <gasps> Okay, I don't know lah. Who cries easily among the two of you? Me. Daily. She's very emotional. emotional. Cry baby. That's not She's a nice She's a Suilong Tho. <laughs> That's a better word. Suilong <laughs> Tho is uh, good when it comes to acting. But my problem now is I cannot control my emotions that well. And I'm trying my very best. But I think it's a good thing because um, you the Kai, her go me the Kai. If overflow, then overflow, then, then, then took it from there. What would be the weaknesses of each other? Maybe I think my sister is very kind hearted. Too kind hearted really. Uh, I think she's afraid of me getting bullied all the time. Yeah, cause it's very tiring to help. You must learn the lesson that you will understand. I must fall down myself. So every time I see like if she's about to fall down, I will try to prevent her from falling down, right? But she rather take the fall. But then that's her way of learning, ah, because everyone journey is different. Does it mean that Hayley would have faced more setbacks than Jane because of her journey? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> but her life is very good leh, up until now. She's very blessed eh. she's like a tea kong kia, eh. I'm a person who don't really think so much. Like, she thinks a lot more than me lah. A lot more That's than she me. don't think I have to think for her. That's the thing ah. We are both Capricorns ah. And we are both like like twins and five minutes apart. But the thing is our character are super different. The way the thought process, the, the the things that we say, the things that we like is quite different. Also. We just say things at the same time sometimes. Yeah, because we're just other chemistry. So well. But what was the worst fight that you guys had? Oh. oh my god, so many. I can't remember. A lot of like we don't really fight these days, so that was like very young years ago. We do have physical fights when we were younger though. Then our mother was like so angry until like she went into the kitchen and took out a knife and said, Come, you can't get it. Really? You want that? Yeah, that was in our old house. That was like very, very long ago when we were in primary like school. The whole block could like hear us. Like, now we don't really fight. We will talk things over civil. Civilly. Civilly. What do you fight about? Anything under the wall. Nitty gritty, man. Because we. Because you're spending every single day with this person Bound to have friction one Like it's very hard to not Unless you're a, you're sane no. You don't have any temperament no. But it's very hard Sometimes I'm just jealous Maybe I'm jealous of her money She got more money than me I save my money She got more endorsement So she will like save, 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 save Because Jenny saves and he splurge I don't really splurge Only once in a while Like during my birthday season then to have two person looking alike in the same industry, don't you guys fight like over roles or? But that's not up to us to decide. Okay? Yeah, lor. We can only do our best during the audition, and then I really hope that my sister will get it. Cause if it's not me, it will be better for her. You know what I mean? And and there is no such thing as like jealous or or what because if your perspective is right, then why should you be? Doing that jealousy yeah, I thing. I always believe like everything happens for a reason. So if you if one door closes, at least a window will open also. So the two of you like watch each other's show like give comments. Yeah we do. Yeah we do. But <laughs> like, will you really be like truthful? Of course, yeah, we are so happy for like you know that's how, how we learn and improve. It's easy to say sugar coated stuff like, oh you act very good. Oh you're so good in this role. Oh it's so easy, but like uh, those people who really really care for you will say the, 
harshest stuff to you because they want you to improve. So who is the better actress? I would say Jiaqi lah. Because she went through more stuff than me. I also don't know how, but yeah, she do. She experienced more stuff than me. And I'm, I'm literally like what she said, I'm like a happy little kid. <laughs> happy go lucky! Happy no, the word kid. Okay. Woman. I don't think I'm the better actress, but I do think that I have more life experience compared to my sister. And um, it does help with acting, whether or not I want to admit to that. But after you go through stuff, right? When you read the script, there's a different understanding. And of course, when I expose myself to people who love acting as well, uh, I learn a lot. But it's very hard to share when you have not been through it yourself. So, yeah. I don't think I'm the best actress, but I do think that I have more life experiences. So, Hailey is the lazy one? She is the lazy one! Oh my god! Don't my zodiac actually that. is a pig. <laughs> I behave like a pig. Actually, like, lately, I find myself... I enjoy doing nothing. I enjoy being in my nothing box. Like just stay at home and just do nothing. I enjoy doing that. I enjoy just sitting on the bed and just blank out. Which is why I sometimes don't understand whether we are from the same age, no? Like seriously, yeah, I cannot eh. There must be some motivation in life for you to like prepare yourself to do something better, right? And but then she enjoy doing nothing a lot eh. It's not just like one day a week, guys. Eh. It's like what? Six days a week? Very quite chang eh, yo. Ask yourself, how many days do you like spend to do stuff that is good for your health or like so nothing? You just sit on the bed, sit on the sofa, then watch Netflix. That's good, man. Netflix is hello, it's helping acting. I'm also analyzing. Yeah, but you're not I'm using, using my brain. You're not. Oh my god. Don't assume you. Who will make a better housewife? <laughs> hmm. I think I'll make a good mother, but I don't think I'll make a good housewife. What makes you think so? She got a lot of 生活大道理 It's not it la. It's just that I know that if I do have a kid in the future or something uh, I will be able to give whatever I have to give In terms of love, in terms of care and concern In terms of what I hope that Like what my parents already gave me So I just wanted to like transfer all that love to my future kid if I do have one. My sister never really wanted to settle down. No, I don't really want to have kids. When I was younger, I always wanted to have I wanted to get married at like 23, have kids at 25. I think just life is too short and I want to like travel the world. And if I have I'm gonna have kids, right? Okay, maybe I'll do like the world traveling one or two years and after that I'll settle down. When you have kids, it's very hard to travel one. You, you, you'll be constantly worried about not. this you kid. You can bring your kid along. Like, you, yeah, but you see how it is, you want to go to the world. My sister thinks that uh, marriage right, is just a piece of paper of certification. It, but honestly, but really, if you love one another, right, why would you need a paper to like come and certify that, oh, you guys are in love? So during that lowest point of your life, your sister played a very important role. Definitely. I have my sister to thank. And uh, she has to put up with a lot of things, with um, whether my emotional or my mental state. And if it's not for her, la, I would be not here sitting and talking to you anymore. So. Yeah. Like, it's really like a seesaw law. Like when she's quieter, I'm louder. When I'm louder, she's quieter. So when she's down, I'll be the up one to pull her up. Not say protect lah, more of encouragement I guess. And at that point of time, I was really like immune to crying. I don't even feel like crying anyway. I, I just feel like... Like, there's nothing worse that can happen already, so... And what was the saying? The only way that... When you're at the bottom, the only way you can go is up. So, I think at the lowest time, at that point of time, that's the lowest already, where else you can go, right? So, yeah, just always look on the bright side. Always look on the bright side of life. Do you remember what's the sweetest thing Ellie done for you? Her being physically there and mentally there for me is uh, yeah, the most that I can ever ask for. Which was why when I um, when my body couldn't take the pain, uh, she was there to like hold me. Uh, and 
I think it's beautiful and amazing at the same time, but it's just nice to have someone there. And I'm thankful that my parents gave birth to a sister. <laughs> because if not, I don't know what I'll do. I think it's been a great ride with Asia One. Mm -hmm. And I just want to say thank you so much for having the two of us on board. And I'll read this right. A five star. Okay, no, 4.5. Because we keep going left. <laughs> like, <laughs> I'll give you guys 14 stars. Because I really like this like session. And uh, actually, I think we. Yeah, actually, it's a good, it's a good yeah, ride. We have a better understanding of one another. Say 14 stars, right? 14. Because usually it's like upon 5 or 10, right? So 14 is confirmed over one, ma. Let's say about 5. Still 14? Thank you so much. <laughs>